So hey guys, it's Bit Glenn here again, and today we're going to talk about Genesis Mining. So um, I really like the look of this Genesis Mining. If you're not too sure what it is, I'll just give a quick description from how I see it. Genesis Mining is a company that have set up mining rigs. So in, it, it, if you want to set up a mining computer, um, but you don't want all the hassle of it, and you're not too sure how to build computers, a bit like what I am. You can actually rent the equipment off this company called Genesis Mining. Now they have all these rigs set up all over the world in places where electricity is cheap. <clears throat> and they have these rows and rows like in these massive warehouses of just tons of GPUs all running at optimal level. They try and keep the air temperature down so that they don't overheat. And obviously it's just a... Um, a mining rig that you could build at home but on a massive scale um, something that obviously you'd probably never be able to do at home so the plus side to this is that obviously they're they're mining um, at a very fast rate and very powerful rate so their hash rate is very good and obviously for you as the consumer you don't have to worry about making equipment putting it all together running software and keep checking it and electricity bills and all stuff like that Where's the downside? So, because otherwise everyone would do this. Um, they mine for you and they transfer money into your account every day in the um, way of Bitcoin. But they actually take a cut and you also have to pay up front. So, you pay for the mining up front um, as a one off payment. So, if I click on the price in here, I'll show you. So, if we go to Bitcoin. You'll see here that you have to pay, a, for this example, $179, which in UK money is about, I don't know, 150 140 something. And with that, you get a 1,000 giga hashes per second. That's how powerful uh, or how many hashes that the computers can run at per second. So that's his, this is how many mathematical equations it can break down in a second. Um, and that's a giga hash. So it's a lot. <laughs> um but unfortunately, these are so popular. I checked it the other day and it actually came up saying available for pre-sale for 28th of February 2018. So if you paid that 179 today, you would be buying the mining equipment or renting it, sorry, to start on the 28th of February. So as of now, which is the 15th of November, you're talking sort of four months down the road. So that they're really popular um, until obviously they have more contracts they're called so that that would be considered one contract there the 179 until they have more contracts come available um, you can't actually mine for Bitcoin through the website so um, obviously something wrong with their business plan or structure in some way because there's people now looking at this like me who want to give them money but I can't I can't give them my money to mine so yeah, they need to look at that, I suppose. Uh, I assume they'll get around it by just keep building more and more equipment um, and offering more contracts out. But you can actually go up, so you've got $845 for 500 giga hash, uh, four grand for 25, and you can actually customize your own one and it goes all the way up to, I believe it was 200 tera hashes. So tera hashes is, is a hundred times more than a giga hash and you could rent 200 of them so yeah it's like mental sort of numbers uh, but that was something like thirty one thousand dollars so yeah uh, a big investment if you think that's the way forward so these are all sold out so it shows that this website's very popular they've been going for a few years now and from what i can gather they haven't really had too many issues they haven't had um oh look here's sort of like the plus and negatives i suppose um they haven't had any sort of bad press, um, not that I know of anyway. But anyway, so I really wanted to get involved in this and I couldn't. So yeah, I'm a bit gutted. Uh, I was really up for um, starting to mine either yesterday or today, but I can't. So again, not a very good start to my cryptocurrency um, journey because now I'm not mining and I'm not really investing in anything. So uh, I've actually got a little... Um, rig going at the moment but i want to sort of play about of it first before i talk about it and do like give you guys my opinions on it 
Um, but yeah, you can actually still use. You'll see up the top here, these are the different coins that you can mine. The ones that are still white, you can you can still do. So if I wanted to, I could go, I can uh, Erythium, I believe that's pronounced, but you can tell me if I'm wrong. So you could pay $30, that's quite a small amount. That's, as I was thinking, that's quite a decent amount uh, to start off with for a beginner just to see what it's like and once you're in there you might be able to upgrade your plan later on and this is for two years so for two years it'll mine for you at one mega hash so mega is less than a giga hash i believe so yeah that's quite a low speed but obviously it's only 30 dollars instead of 869 so it's quite a small amount to sort of jump into um i'd probably go a little bit higher maybe um Let's have a little look. $90, that's about 70 quid for me. That's three mega hashes. And see how many coins I can get with that. Um, and that'll mine for you for two years. Now with that, there is no maintenance fee. So they don't take the cut, as far as I'm aware, um, which they do with Bitcoin. They take quite a hefty cut out of it. Um, so you can actually mine that uh, particular coin um, and these other ones, Zcash, Monero. Um, they're a bit more expensive. I quite I can't quite get my head around their pricing structure either, so it doesn't make it very clear. I assume they're going on by the price of the coins at that point in time. So obviously Bitcoin, because you believe you think that you're renting the power to mine, so surely you should just it should just be one tera hash is this much, what you know ten tera hash is this much or giga hash. But on this website, it seems different hash rates, I assume, because the difficulty to mine this particular coin is less than another one, therefore not needing as much power to get the same sort of results, so then less uh, monthly fee. But again, I, it's different price, even with the coins that are available here. So this one's $30 for one mega hash, whereas with the others, that one's $50 for 60 hash per second. So no mega, no thousands or terras, it's just hashes. Um, and that's $50 essentially. Um, again, two year plan. So yeah, a bit all over the place really. So you really need to sort of think about, I suppose, what coin it is that you're after. So if you really want this uh, Ethereum, um, you know, you would just look at their price. Don't try and confuse yourself by looking at all the different prices and comparing which one's the best value for money and stuff like that, I suppose. Um, because it's actually quite hard to work out. But anyway, obviously I was a bit gutted because the Bitcoin uh, pre-sale has now sold out, so I can't buy any Bitcoin. I may jump in and do the um, uh, Ethereum one and see how I get on with that, see what it rewards me and how easy it is. Um, like I say, I'm just trying out at the minute. So I'm trying out all these different websites, different currencies, um, different way of doing it. And uh, I'd love to hear your thoughts, guys. So have you mined in the past? Did you see a return on it? Was it worth doing? Um, what was your experience of using Genesis Mining? Um, from what I gather and what I've seen online, really good reputable company and everyone seems to really enjoy it hence why they're sold out so you know if something's sold out loads of people are after it i saw some youtube videos of people that were literally just sitting here refreshing the page over and over again until they could actually buy one of these um so obviously they're they're in demand so this got me thinking about what other websites are out there maybe that are just as good as genesis mining um, so if you want to comment down below, um, please feel free to let me know uh, other sites that you think are worth having a look at. Also, I've got um, a link for Genesis Mining. If you go down to my uh, description below, there's a little link to this website and uh, there's a code, I believe. And when you buy, if you decide that you want to buy one of these contracts, um, you get 3% off. So if you imagine some of these are like you know $800 or whatever, whatever one it is you decide to go for, you'd get 3% off that when you go to the checkout and use my code. Um, and I don't receive any money in that, but they do as an incentive provide me with hash power for free. So in my account, I would have some hash um, that I can use on a currency. So sort of like an incentive 
uh, for me to recommend you guys. But I just want you guys to go out there and obviously try it and see how you, what you think of it. If you don't want to use the code, don't use it. Um, but it's out there if you do want to save yourself a little bit of money and help me along the way. And uh, yeah, I'll look forward to hearing from you guys. I've actually set up a Facebook BitGlen page. So just type in BitGlen in Facebook page group. Um, Instagram BitGlen and Twitter BitGlen. So feel free, I've, on those pages, all I've um, got on them is cryptocurrency news and reports um, and images and um, yeah, things about Bitcoin in the cryptocurrency world. So uh, that's all I'll be doing on that. I won't be posting sort of like what I'm doing during the day and stuff like that. It'll just be cryptocurrency stuff. And uh, hopefully you guys can add me and like me on those things um, and obviously comment what you think I'm doing is right or wrong or if you have any advice or if you know you find these videos helpful you can help me and offer suggestions of what you'd like me to sort of have a look at and review next so I'll see you guys on the next video please subscribe uh, to this channel to get more videos I'm going to try and post one sort of either every day uh, sort of Monday to Friday if I can and if I've got enough to talk about I don't just want to blabber for nothing so <laughs> um, I'll see you guys on the next episode of BitGlen. cheers bye